The Charles Wilson Building. Dennis Lasden, 1966. What's left to say about Lasden? Hmm? One of Britain's greatest modern architects. A true pioneer of the form. Hey! How cool to see another photographer here. Are you a photographer? Not professional. Not yet, anyway. You know, some would say you're not even an unprofessional photographer if you're shooting on that. What does that mean? I'm not professional because I'm shooting on a phone. Or do you genuinely think that is a camera? Yeah. Real photography is something you feel, something tangible. There's more to this than just pushing a button and letting AI do the rest, yeah? So you learn the craft, and then we can talk about professionalism. Oh my God, gatekeeping much? Gatekeeping, you know, I hear that all the time, like it's a bad thing. Owning an iPhone isn't a skill. You are such a snob. Who shoots on film anymore? People who are passionate about their craft. Mate, you need to climb down from your high horse. Everyone's a photographer nowadays. OK, we're done. We're done. You play around with the light or whatever it is Instagrammers do, all right? I was being nice. Prick. Let's try this again. Lee Circle Car Park. Fitzroy Robinson and Partners, 1961. Unedifying to the untrained eye, this is an important structure that encapsulates how our nation has changed since the 1960s. Once upon a time, this concrete cathedral was Europe's largest car park and supermarket. A pioneering experiment, the double helix design was a model of efficiency. This was a building designed to work, a space for people to live. For a brief moment, it was magnificent. Yet within a few short years, successive governments moved away from social architecture, leaving these great buildings to fall into disrepair. Profit became more important than the lived experience. Brutalist buildings began to symbolize, unfairly, the dereliction of our communities. This rejection of the idea of society means we've ended up in a world that looks like this. More than any other form of expression, architecture shows us, time and again, people get what they deserve. Thank <laughs> you.